Hi everybody, this is Sam Jensen here with Kibble Equipment. Today I'm going to show you how to use John Deere Data Manager inside of Operation Center. So, the first thing you're going to want to do is load up your My Operation Center here. As you can see on my screen, I'm loaded up here. Make sure you're right in the correct organization. For now, I'm for this purpose, I'm going to be using Kibble Tech Expo. And the next thing you want to do is navigate to the More tab here at the top and then find John Deere Data Manager. So Data Manager is used for importing your data from your displays, whether it be 2630 or Gen 4 displays, bringing that information into the operation center. And so that way you can use your field analyzer tools or your land tools, create new boundaries and look at your different data inside the operation center. So once you have your Data Manager pulled up, this is the screen that's gonna come up. As you can see on here, it says it works with Windows and Mac computers. So no matter the computer you have, no matter what you're running, you'll be able to use Data Manager. From there, then you click Download. And then down here at the bottom, you can select Open When Done. And then once that is down, done downloading, it'll have you install it on your computer. And I'll walk you through that step as well. So now the Welcome menu comes up. And here you can select next, next, and then make sure it is downloading on the right spot on your computer, and then hit install. Once the green progress bar goes all the way across, then you can hit finish. So now, as soon as you hit finish, it's gonna pop up with this screen here. This screen is your loading screen for the John Deere Data Manager. Once this is done loading, you'll come up with a new window, and that'll be your data management window. So now your data management screen your window popped up and at the top here you're going to say you're going to see where it says from and this is where your storage device is going to be so you're going to drop down and hit browse select your usb that you took from your displays i have mine labeled as display data and then you're going to select folder and then down here at the bottom you're going to see your data here for this case, I don't have it named as anything, but it is a shape file, so it says shape data here. And if you wanted, if you had multiple files at this top corner right here, you'd check that box and you'd select all the data. And if you didn't want to do that, you can uncheck it and then check as many as you want. So for in this case, I'm gonna hit select all, and then we are gonna load it into our correct organization. Once you see that your organization says two right here and this says your organization in this example again cable tech expo then you can go navigate to the bottom right corner and hit upload once that green status bar goes all the way across up here it'll say finish uploading and at that point you are good to go and everything should be uploaded into your operation center and you can go back in and look at your data there to check to make sure all your files came in you can go here in your operation center, navigate to files underneath the more tab. Once you are here, you can see data manager has this uploaded by me. You can see it was uploaded today. And if you want to check there, you can go into content and see if there's anything, all any of your field names or client farm field is in there. And that's where you're going to find it. That is how you use John Deere data manager.